Jason Hillhouse. I work on the one half of Blue Bomber Games who works on Looking for Heels. This is the action adventure game where the healer runs the show. He has you uh, you play as the healer, of course, and he has four allies who he takes around the battlefield, sends them off to fight, they decide what they do, and you pull them back when it gets too hot and heavy, and then uh, that's the majority of the game. It's really just keeping them alive with your healing, your shield, and your revive spells when they, uh, when they go down. So I noticed that most of the most of the characters look like they have basically the same build. They've got swords. Are there a bunch of different types of allies you can recruit in the game? There are. As you go on, you get rogues, you get rangers, and all of those have very distinct uh, abilities that unlock different parts of the level. They also um, can uh, are required for certain boss fights. So it's uh, yeah, you kind of really get to use all your your fighters. Over but time. the player always has to control the healer. Yes. So I find that very interesting personally because I was on a team developing a game with that same premise where there's a bunch of different characters but you had to play as the healer. Our game actually got shut down. We weren't able to finish really? because uh, playtesters reported that they didn't have fun. Like we failed to make the healer interesting. Okay. And this game looks really fun. How did you how did you make the healer class fun even though that's not normally the class people play in a game like this? I think it was all about just uh, keeping it really simple and just uh, not having and just making the combat really have a lot of good game feel to it. Lots of you see there's lots of explosions, lots of coins that go everywhere. Just really having fun with the uh, using what's a support class and just right. kind of turning it on its head. Are there any? So I, you, you've mentioned that the character can heal and the character can revive. Are there any other additional support bil- abilities that you can unlock? Yeah, like maybe uh, buffing. Uh, you get shield off the bat too, but uh, the next pass we're going to do, we're going to basically try to cover all the healing classes of, of the game world, basically. So whether you played Overwatch or whether you played World of Warcraft, we want to get area of effect healing or nice. healing, healing bullets. Uh, basically, just like uh, melee healing, we just kind of want to build a big toolkit for the player to just decide how they want to uh, heal their. Oh, that sounds. Party. Do you think Lucio's speed boost is going to get in there in any way, shape, or form? Maybe his area of effect healing. Yeah. His area of effect, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Lucio's my favorite healer of all time. Oh, he so was fantastic. I'm yeah. really excited to hear that. Absolutely. Uh, is this game out yet, or is it? It's uh, coming soon right now on Steam, but uh, we're looking for early access around uh, the middle of summer right now. Nice. Well, I hope you're able to land it, man. Thanks. This game looks awesome. Appreciate it. Thank Thank you for talking to me about it. Absolutely.